Hi everyone, welcome to another one of these video tutorials. Today I'm going to teach you how to create a PDF file but enabling non-Acrobat Pro users to actually sign it. So here we have our Word file. Take it, save it, and go to Acrobat right here. Click on Create PDF. It's going to give you that option save it. I'm going to pause for meanwhile while it's converting. Here we are with a freshly made PDF file. Now this is where I want to create the signature fields. So go to forms, add or edit fields, and it's going to ask currently there are no form fields in this PDF. Do you want Acrobat to detect form fields for you? click no because or if you click yes then uh, Acrobat's just going to fill it up with with different fields okay and uh, it might be a bit of a hassle I'm, I'm more like this so you have that go to your signature tool button and draw it in I'm gonna oops it does that to you sometimes. I'm going to leave it there and place multiple fields. By the way, for those who didn't catch me do that, I'm gonna undo that selection actually. I right click that. So if you draw your signature field, if you want it in, instead of copying and pasting it, just right click it and go to place multiple fields. So here I'm going to add for, I'm going to ask for three. So now control click those two and you can move them down. I recommend you uh, moving them down with the pointers instead of the mouse because you could possibly move it a bit sideways. So we have three signature fields there. Close form editing. And here you go. Now we're missing one last step. Go to advanced and extend features in Adobe Reader. Yeah. Now we're going to save it and replace existing file. And here we go. You have to do that last step in order to have someone who doesn't have Adobe Acrobat Pro sign this. Okay. Now when they receive it, Adobe is going to ask them a certain number of questions. Okay. Have them accept whatever they deem necessary. Read the steps. Okay. I'm more prone into not uh, going with the certified options, but that's just me. Why you may ask? Because maybe the uh, whoever's in charge of receiving the file back can find out that there was a typo, or maybe he wants to continue making this uh, a feel uh, a form. I mean, okay, and he can actually do that. But if if they accept that, then I, there might be a chance he won't. I'm not entirely sure though. Well, thank you for listening. I hope this was useful for you. Bye bye, everyone.